why this film now? Why, why did you choose this one of any ones that you could choose from? Yeah, I, mean, I was trying to get to what I think of is the anatomy of violence, why it happens. It's, it's a film obviously not about the victim because there was no way I wanted to uh, re-victimize the victim. Uh, the film is about the men. What makes a rapist? Are men born rapists or do they become rapists? What is it in society that contributes uh, to their being? I think we have time for one more question. But I'm just wondering, maybe it's like more of the social structures that needs to be worked on. Oh, of the yeah, welcome. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes, of course it's a social structure. It's, it's not it's not as simple. I said the only thing that's come out of this has been at least that the laws have, have been, you know, have been changed. But uh, what, what we absolutely have to, have, if we all are complicit in it, is as a society, you know, it's our responsibility to break the cycle. We have to stop thinking of women in a particular way, which is a second class citizen. I don't know what it's like in Iceland, but in the rest of the world it is like that. That's the reality. My favorite film director is a Spanish filmmaker called Buñuel. He said something that always stays with me. He said, the minute you are very particular is the very minute you become universal.